Another day, another dollar with your homeboy, Jermaine. And what, now it's what, nine? I gotta get ready to rush off to this test rabbit gig. It's actually not nine, it's six minutes before nine. So I should be rushing out of the house now. This gig is really close to my house. It's about 10 minutes away. So I'm gonna go put the battery on the bike and cycle down there pretty quick and knock out this job. It should be one to two hours and I'll be back here chilling man it is hot out there i am glad to be back here honestly i don't know if i even want to go back outside today I mean, i'm gonna have to at least put some summer clothes on or something i guess i should have checked the weather this morning but check the weather for what like you the weather's so unpredictable around here if they say it's gonna be foggy maybe it's gonna be foggy if they say it's gonna rain maybe it's gonna rain if they say it's gonna be a heat wave Maybe it's gonna be a heat wave. Maybe Jermaine should just pay more attention to other things in life. I had to get out of the house. Vanessa had a whole bunch of girlfriends over and they're all really loud, you know, doing their whole thing. And I just said, man, I, I'm, I gotta go. I'm gonna bounce out. I'm gonna go, go to the city. I thought about going to Berkeley and then I said, come on, why would I go to Berkeley? What do I ever do in Berkeley? So, I'm headed to the city now. All right, finally made it on BART. For some reason, this train hasn't left yet. I've been here for like 60 seconds. But check this out. I'm on the way to the city, and I just accepted this test rabbit gig. This one is to go do the, the sheets and the tiles for an Airbnb. So I'm, I'm pretty stoked. This is like a two hour job, and I'll have plenty of time to like edit my vlogs during those two hours. So it looks like, looks like the cops just grabbed the, the cops just grabbed this guy off the train, and I'm in a car pretty far back. Well, they just let him go. Are we ever gonna leave? Question mark. Before I show up to this job, of course I need to get quarters. So I'm just stopping in this Walgreens really fast and see how many quarters they can give me on one transaction. Thank you, 7-Eleven. So I went to Walgreens. They were only able to give me three dollars and quarters, and I bought what some slices of watermelon. You know, super overpriced. And then I went to 7-Eleven and I got two bananas, and they were actually able to give me a roll of quarters. So I got what 13 bucks and quarters to start off with. And this gig is, oh gosh, it's up this hill and then another block. So I got two blocks of these massive hills to go up. Let's get this party started. I'm trying to get into this place. This door is not working. Maybe I'll try this other door. I've never did a job like this before, but I don't mind doing it. This job seems pretty cool. Oh, this works. Where is this going to? Wow. Okay. Walk on top of me. I don't know where I'm at. Okay. I gotta go this way. And then I'm gonna go up. Cool, here's the washer and dryer. No one's using it. I better hurry up and go up and get the clothes so I can uh, use that washer and dryer. And figure out how to get up in this building. This is one old building. Is this the elevator? What the heck? Oh, that is the elevator. Hear the elevator calm right now. Oh, I love these elevators. These are the best ones. Cause they let you sit down like this while you're riding up. What's wrong with this joint? Is it going up? There we go. Yippee! You can take that off. We rocking and rolling, rocking and rolling, and rocking and rolling. Alright, I gotta find this place. Oh, look at that. Emergency exit. What's out there? Oh, it's that slanted street. <laughs> That's fine. Come on. We gotta accomplish what we're here for. Here it is. This is a little creepy. Hello? 
Hello. I don't know. Seems to be cool. Hey, it's an Airbnb. And I just have to do the laundry here. This is uh, weird. I'm just like in someone else's house now. I guess these are the sheets. I'm gonna go start on these now. Just got the clothes started and I don't think I'll even need that many quarters actually. I think I could have been okay with maybe like $10 worth of quarters. So that stress is over with and I'm back in this guy's apartment. Obviously this is a guy's house because you can tell just by, you know, just going in the bathroom and looking. There's a whole bunch of dude stuff and just also in here. He's obviously like some sort of electrician or something. I don't know. But yeah, this is the Airbnb. This is the Airbnb job. This is pretty simple. Um, I just have to wait about 30 minutes for the clothes to finish in the washer and then I will put them in the dryer and be along my way. Client just texted me. There's a pizza box in the fridge. Let's go handle that. Hmm, this is really good. Just finished that test wrap gig, and today I'm done right now. When I say it's hot, I mean it's hot. Like, it's wicked hot. Like, I feel a breeze, but it doesn't really matter. It's still hot. Um, I don't even know what I'm gonna do now. I guess I'm gonna, I don't know. I'll figure something out. Where did the day go? I haven't vlogged in like a couple hours now. So, earlier I was cycling on Market Street. I met up with Joshua. We hung out for quite a bit. And now I am getting ready to, I don't know, it's what, it's 5.44, I'm going to do the live stream at 7, so either I go home now or I guess I could go to WeWork now because I know it's going to be super hot in my house and I don't know, it could also be a whole bunch of people there too. So maybe I'll just do the live stream at WeWork, therefore I'll just stay in the city. Oh, I wonder what's going on over there. Looks like... There's some sort of band or something getting ready to play over there. But yeah, I think I'll go to WeWork, get ready for the live string, and then just uh, chill out. Uh, it's been a super, super hot day. Right now, it's cooled off a lot downtown. I feel a breeze. A little, well, I don't feel a breeze right here, but yeah, definitely over there, I feel a massive breeze. It's definitely starting to cool off, but it's still really, really warm. It's just, uh, wherever there's a breeze, it's much cooler. Are uh, you okay? Whoa, that dude back there? That guy was at least 50 years old. He was like literally coming down Market Street. Like I, I just got off my bike, just locked my bike up. He was literally coming down Market Street, like flying, like just doing this swerve thing. And he just like took this crazy dip and fell right there. And I like turned around and saw, and I was locking up my bike, and I was like, dude, that's nuts. Like, he ate, shh. Yeah, he fell hard. Like, I just had to ask if he was okay. Like, man, I, I thought he broke up. I thought he broke an arm or something. In the mall now, I'm about to go get a complete cookie. Look at those cookies. Those are definitely non-vegan, but I'm sure um, a lot of people out there would love one of those. <laughs> All right, here go them complete cookies. Lemon poppy seed, that's the one. We've been we work now. Just finished up with live stream. And I don't know, just ready to call it a night. Just gotta get the bike, get on BART, go back to Oakland, get in bed, wake up really early in the morning and come back and do all of this over again. Yep, that's exactly what is on the agenda for now. So my car is not working. Such a nice night out there in the city and just got on bar here. I think this is funny. No you're here, no urinating or defecating. <laughs> it's like, I, I hope you wouldn't want to do that on the elevator, but I guess people do it all the time because these elevators always reek. Waiting on this train. I got what two minutes to wait. Man, it's so quiet in here. Maybe I should just shh, be quiet.
Hey, check out the, it's like the perfect place for this, huh? And right near the BART tracks. Definitely wouldn't want anyone jumping on the tracks, especially in rush hour. So I think I'm gonna get ready to call it a night. I'm gonna have to edit this vlog and it is super hot in here. Y'all know we don't have AC, so I'm just dealing with it. Did I sit on something back here? Some CDs or some tapes. Let's start listening to these. This is my girlfriend right here. This is my girlfriend right here, cassettes. Like, who still listen to these? Like, I do not own a cassette, a tape, a CD, I don't own any of those. This is my girl, still got these old cassettes. Records and stuff. I know, it's collector's items, but me, I'm all like high tech and digital. But anyway, I gotta edit this vlog, and like I say, it is, it's a scorcher in here. I'll see y'all tomorrow, let's do it all over again. Peace.